Ben, you had a, a really strong start of La Vuelta. Now we are in the third week. We know it's the first for sure. Uh, how are you? Uh, I'm good. I'm happy that there's only three days left. Two and a half. Uh, Today? Yeah. No, but I'm, I'm, I'm feeling good and ready to keep fighting till Madrid. But Today? I'm tired like everybody. <laughs> Today can be a stage for you. It's a it's a long climb. It's quite regular. It's kind of climb you you, you seem to like. Uh, if the breakaway goes to the finish, but I think today you're going to see more of a GC battle because if Valverde takes the 10 second time bonus, then he's 10 seconds closer in the overall and with only 25 seconds behind and um, two more chances for him. So I'm not sure the breakaway is going to survive today, but we have to see how it goes. And you think? Tomorrow is a better op opportunity, or now the battle for the GC will take over the, the, the battle for the stages? Tomorrow, um, tomorrow is a chance for the King of the Mountains jersey, for me personally. Um, but I think the stage is going to be for the GC guys. And today, if by chance you arrive in the breakaway, how do you have to manage this last climb, which is long, regular? It's long and regular, but it's also altitude. So I think you have to keep that in your mind that if you do these uh, big, powerful attacks and efforts, it costs you. If you go over the red at altitude, then it's hard to recover. Um, more difficult than at lower elevations where there's more oxygen. So um, I think you have to play smart, uh, play to your own ability, do your own race, and um, yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good luck.